Hello and welcome to another Cognos Analytics 11 demo. My name is Kwame Owuku. I'm a consultant at Cognetics. Please visit cognetics.com to learn more about our services. In this demo, I'm going to show you how to create a drill through report between a master report and a detail report. So the concept of drill through is the ability to pick a data point and using this data point to be able to see the details behind that specific data point. So case in point, I have a report here showing the NFL teams, their conference and their division. And when I run this report in HTML, okay, All right, so when I run the report, it shows the teams, the conference, the division, and then some other attributes, okay? So when I click on, say, AFC East, I will expect this to trigger another report to open, and that is the detail report. And this detail report will have information um, about the AFC East teams and two charts. So to be able to accomplish this, I need to create a drill through on division and I'll pass the division value over to the detail report. So for me to do this first, I'm going to take out the drill through that I created before. And also I'm going to open the detail report so that I can start everything over again. All right, so here's the detail report. Okay, and the first thing I have to do with the detail report um, is showing is showing a prompt that I added before. Essentially, I need to add a filter or a prompt to enable it to accept the data value that I'll be passing over to the detail report. Okay, so let's see. I'm going to go over to the to the to the um, query, right? Okay. And you see that I have this division filter built into the detail report. Essentially, when I click on the division value in the master report, I expect it to filter the detail report uh, so that it shows me the value, the only the values like uh, case and point. Remember, I clicked on NFC um, East and actually AFC East and it filtered the detail report to show the uh, the AFC East teams. So to be able to do this, you have to add this filter to the detail report to accept that value. Okay. So all I did was pull the division filter over to the filters um, area and I created the parameter to accept the division value from the master report. Very straightforward. So after you've, you've done that to the detail report, you know, you've created that filter to accept the parameter, you will have to engineer the drill through. And to do that, I have to go to edit mode. I select the division um, attribute, you know, because it is the column that I intend to use for the drill through. I go over to, actually, I click here and I go over to the th drill through definitions. I click add and I first have to point to the detail report. So I go to where the detail report is located and then I, I, this action will specify what happens when I click on the division uh, column and the format I want the output to be, I'll choose HTML. And um, the, here is where I engineer the value to be passed. So here I say if you click on if you click on the division um, column, I want you to pass the value and I want to use the division as the value um, to to pass when you click on the division column. okay? So with this done, if I run the report now, you're going to see that the division column is highlighted and every time you highlight any of the values, you see that the hand sign comes up. 
this tells me that there's something is going to occur when I click on any of these values. So if I click on NFC South, it is going to pass NFC South over to the detail report and it's going to show only the NFC South teams in the detail report and it's also showing that same behavior in the charts below. So to go to 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 repeat what I what I just did, essentially all you have to do is create a filter in the detail report, the detail report um, query, and then you create the link between the master report and the detail report by going through the steps that I showed you where you first find the location of the detail report, you specify the action when you click on the, um, you click on the, the value, what happens when you click on the value is it will run the report and run it in HTML. And uh, that is where, this is where I engineered that the master report passes the division value whenever um, that data point is clicked. So that is what I wanted to show you. It's very straightforward and, you know, anyone can do it.